Hi there folks, it's Diksha from Fix Me. So in my last video I spoke about the 80% of the population that has allegedly got one leg longer than the other, but they don't actually. It's a virtual one, it's an illusory one, it's caused by bad posture, standing on one hip. Um, and then I spoke about what to do about it, to stand equally on both your feet, and number three I also say, showed you a stretch to do, to stretch out that really stuck tight part of your lower back muscles. But there is the 20% that actually does have one leg longer than the other, and that can be caused by a birthing defect, an injury, uh, an operation. I have got older clients who have had hip replacements and knee replacements that have ended up actually creating a leg length difference because the gaps in the joints have been changed simply because the surgeon's gone in and does his little bit. If that is the case, and the only person who can check that out is a therapist who knows what he or she is doing, if that is indeed the case, then you need orthotics. Please, 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 you need to go and get some orthotics done because if you maintain that leg length difference, you are Mr. or Mrs. Hop Along, you are worsening the condition of your musculoskeletal status, potentially causing tightness in the back, you are causing a misalignment which over a period of time can lead to arthritis with the joints rubbing against each other, not worth it. Or if you're an athlete, you could just be prone to too many injuries. So get it checked out. Go to a podiatrist. I tend to use Susan Sandal at the Brightwell Clinic in Reading. She's very, very good. Get it assessed and get some orthotics made. Any problems, give me a call. I'm Diksha from Fixed Me. Hope that has helped. Glad to have you on board. Thank you.